Hello, good morning everyone. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Ngayon ay magluluto tayo ng isang healthy meal. Ito ay ang gisadong bichuelas or sauteed long beans. And it's going to come with some other vegetables like mushrooms and carrots. Halika, luto na tayo. Let's cook! First, I'm going to be um, uh, using about five big uh, shrimps or f- prawns. Uh, I'm just going to be using five and I'm going to be cutting this into halves. I'm going to be uh, removing the shells and setting it aside. And then I'm going to be grinding those shells and using it as flavoring for our guisado or sauteed. Uh, meal. Let's start by cutting the uh, shrimp into halves, removing or deveining them, and set this aside. Then we're going to also be cutting some uh, pork, cutting it into, into cubes and setting it aside. And then we're going to do the saute. I'll be using half an onion and just doing this uh, in small slices and also some garlic and tomatoes. I have some leftover mushrooms from my last recipe so I'm going to be using them here on this uh, meal Um, this is also complementary with our bichuelas or long beans i'm also going to be adding about two carrots and slicing them thinly so it will add some sweetness natural sweetness to our dish I'm going to be searing the uh, pork, just a little quick shear. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to be grinding the shrimp skins and heads and turning it into a shrimp juice for our um, liquid for this uh, recipe. I'm going to start the sauteing using my about one tablespoon of garlic, minced garlic. Followed by our onions and tomatoes. And tomatoes should be well cooked on this uh, recipe. So I'm going to be covering it and simmering it for about a few minutes. After a few minutes, we're going to be adding the rest of the ingredients. Starting with the shrimp, or our sliced shrimp. I cut them into halves. And also seasoning it with my mama my mama si tagisa. Seasoning. Ay nako. Nabubulol na ako. Mahirap tong magtaglish. quick stir and let it cook a little and then we're going
going to be adding some patis to flavor it and of course our liquid will be the shrimp juice I strain them to remove the residue Let this simmer for a few minutes again and then you can, we can add the rest of the ingredients. You can use patis or if you want more saltiness you can also use salt but I use patis since I already had the gisa mix. quick taste test a little salty add uh, liquid if that's the case in this case I added half a cup of water I also season it with black pepper just a few sprinkle goes my mushroom and carrots let it boil and cook Then add the bichuelas, long beans, and cook this for another 10 to 15 minutes. I like my bichuelas to the uh, well done cooking, not halfway. So um, I will cover this and let it boil for a few minutes. I also added some uh, scallion. It's also a leftover from my last cooking, so I don't waste them. So I used it here. It's optional. You don't have to if you don't have uh, the scallion. I'm just using some leftover vegetables and utilize them. It also adds flavor too, I think. This is a very flexible, uh, flexible meal. Um, you can add uh, whatever leftover vegetables you have in your refrigerator. You can add cauliflower, you can add lima beans, or you can add sweet peas. Very um, adjustable. Uh, when it comes to uh, adding vegetables, it can take any vegetables. But um, traditionally, it's just bituelas and carrots. But uh, since I have some leftovers, I use them all up here. Well, we're almost done here. We're ready to eat. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your support and follow, like, and share if you can. Thank you and have a wonderful day, everyone.